Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. This is Kitty and it is Friday and of course I'm painting as I do every chance I get. I come home from work on Fridays and I'm ready to paint. Come home every day during the weekday and I'm thinking about painting. But I'm either varnishing or resining or cleaning paintings. So I have all week to think about what I want to do and and then I just do it. So today I'm going to use colors that I'm not really used to. Green and yellow. I really do want to do more greens and more yellows and since I am stuck on purples and blues and because well I love them and pinks and so I, I want to I wanna do some greens and yellows. So I, I don't know how it's gonna come out, but I'm trying it. I am experimenting. So this is a this is, this is an eight by eight canvas and I am using artist loft. Oh, you cannot see that. Artist Loft Sap Green and Creative Inspirations Deep Yellow. Some Liquitex Gold. And my Artist Loft Flow Acrylics Black. So that's it. That's all I got. So I'm just going to flip my two little cups here. It's probably going to be more than enough paint, but I just want to make sure I had enough because I always say I don't know if I have enough, and I always do. So, paint straight in the cups, and let's just let's do this. And um, I did spray my little cups with the WD-40 silicone spray helps release the paint from the cups and my paints are um, they do have the spot on treadmill silicone probably about oh I think I do like one drop for every two ounces so I think these bottles are I want to say 12 ounces so I do probably I don't know. I don't. I don't want to put a whole lot in there, but I probably did about four, maybe five, when I was mixing them. But all right, let's see how this comes out. That's pretty cool. Where are you going? I'm not ready for you to go over the edge there. Right. Well, as you can see, I got some pretty cool cells. Let's see if I can show you guys. How cool is that? So I don't think I'm going to torch it. I'm just going to tilt it. So. I think I will do it this way. Sometimes I wonder if going fast is better than slow. Just to do it. You know, I don't I don't know. This side. Okay. 
I'm thinking. No, there's one. I'll put a lot of hair. Since it's already falling. Let's see if I can. Anything else? Just to help it. So I don't lose all of it. I'm doing that so I don't lose a whole lot of the design. I mean, I kind of like that in there, but that got kind of, what is the word, wonky? Let's see if I can't just put this over here to blow a little bit. So my paint has been sitting for a long time, a lot of them, so I really don't know how long paint will last, but um, Right now, I'm just kind of trying to get some kind of a design going on over here. I'm wondering how many of you have already told me to stop. <laughs> I know, I never know when. Probably already should have though, huh? See all these bald spots? I don't I don't like that. It's 
And they say it's because the, the silicone hits the canvas first. Okay. But how does how does that happen? Like I don't get it. If you mix your paints really well. I mean it shouldn't be on top, should it? I don't know. I don't know what to do with it. <laughs> Should I stop? Tell you what, let me. I think I'm done, really. I'm just going to have to baby it and keep uh, filling in all those spots there that keep popping up and try to get them to, until it settles at least. That's usually what I do if, if a painting does that. I'll sit and babysit it until it starts setting. And it'll be okay. Let me bring you guys for a close up after I clean it. And not drop it. Alright. There's some cool little things happening in there. Now if it'll only focus. There it goes. And there is gold in there, so some of it some of it will shimmer when it is all dry. And she'll be even more cool. But I think I'm going to just baby it and um I think that's it for this one, I guess. I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it. Um yeah, so I don't know, should I torch it? Anybody anybody saying yes? Maybe I should, huh? Let me torch it. See what we can get. I mean I have there's plenty of cells in there, but you know, just to get out the bubbles. different. I think I will play around with more um, of the green and yellow. Maybe maybe some Van Dyke Brown. That's an idea. Maybe I'll try that. But all right you guys, another one done. A new experiment for me, different colors for sure. And um, Subscribe if you haven't. Please like and share my videos and hit that bell and you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. And um, yeah, thank you guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.